Hello and welcome to Wine Wednesday with William. Wines that have hitherto been overlooked from vines that have been usually purposed for other things than wine are now offering real bargains for people looking for fresh summer wines from the south of France. Now, this wine is made from a great variety that is notorious for being really tart, really sharp. It's called Peak Pool, and it comes from a village called Pinay. Now, the Peak Pool is um, that feeling you get when you've cut your lip and you squeeze lemon juice on it. It's a stinging sensation. And it was called Peak Pool, which is, means literally lip stinger, because it was so tart. And the reason it was so tart was because even in the south of France, it was really hard to ripen. Now, that's no longer the case. The grapes are being picked later, and the climate's warmer, and the wine is good value and deeply refreshing. Just further down the coast, we have this wine, made from a blend of Colombard and Uniblanc, strange things. It's called Trebbiano Uniblanc in Italy, so you might be more familiar with it from that point of view. Almost all sort of inexpensive Italian white wines is um, Trebbiano, sort of the things like, um, like, like Orvieto, for example, or Frascati, those sorts of things. Anyway, this is made into a still wine from grapes that used to supply the distilleries that produced Armagnac. Nobody drinks Armagnac anymore, but you can't tell that to the vines. They still produce fruit, and now they produce this absolutely lovely crisp white wine. Whether it's global warming or whether it's the commercial imperatives of a market that no longer likes fortified wines, both of these wines are exciting opportunities for people who normally might be drinking California wines to try uh, something a little different and save some money at the same time.